Hi, this is Donnie Smith. In this video, I'm going to talk about paintless cars. I uh, first heard about that uh, this summer. I was at 3M, their headquarters, and they was talking about the car makers, some of their biggest uh, uh, problems or concerns was, you know, the EPA and, and you know, the paint and, you know, the env environmental problem that comes with that. And they talked about, you know, in the future possibly developing ways to wrap cars with vinyls rather than paint, you know, not having painted cars from the factory. Well, here recently, I, you know, read uh, a headline that talked about 3M partnering with some uh, steel manufacturers, and I don't know if it's going to be different types of steels, aluminums, carbon fibers, but it's in the process where they are going to be, uh, they're in the, in the development stage of, of, of making cars that are not going to have paint. And uh, this is going to be some changes in the repair industry. Because if cars are not using paint, you know, if they're wrapped from the factory, that means that we're going to have to wrap them whenever we repair them. Now, I don't know if they're going to come already with the, you know, the correct color on them, or if we order a right front fender, uh, do we order it pre-colored, you know, do we give them the color and they send it wrapped? I mean, I don't know. There's going to be a lot of uh, changes in the collision repair industry. Uh, one thing I think we need to start looking into, though, is, is maybe a... Uh, you know, learning what technologies we are going to have to learn for these new cars. Now, um, you know, it's a change that we're dealing with. Uh, you know, what got me passionate in this industry is paint. I love to paint cars. I hate to see it go away. I mean, I understand that this uh, vinyl is a, you know, a green technology and all that. But, you know, I, I, I remember painting my first car in high school, you know, and stepping back and seeing that paint. You know, just where all the magic is done to me. And, uh, but, you know, things are going to change, you know, whether we like them or not. If you think about it, you know, look at, uh, you know, carburetors. You know, once that change uh, took place, you know, a carburetor became outdated pretty fast. Or, um, you know, VCRs, and we had the DVDs to, out, uh, to outdate the VCRs. And, and now, you know, in the town that I live in, you think about rental uh, stores that rent movies. Uh, our last one just went out of business not too long ago. There's not even one here. It's a smaller town. Uh, we now have the, the red box and those type of things where you just put your card in and get the movie that way. So we don't even have a rental place here. So things are changing and cars are changing. It's going to change the way we needed to, to do the, the repairs. It leaves a lot of questions, but it's something to think about. And I'd like to see what you think about it. Uh, you know, I'd like to hear your comments. Just go down below the video and leave me a comment there what you think about paintless cars and uh, you know what you think is gonna what that's gonna mean for the collision repair industry in the future anyway that wraps up this video thanks for watching be sure and share this and and uh, like it and we'll talk to you next time